Hi guys, welcome to our first ever Ghosty Gram. I thought I'd do a tack up and hack with me and G. Anyway, I'm putting on G's bridle now. This isn't his normal bridle. This is in fact the bridle I hunted and it was really cheap because I usually use a Micklum. His Micklum's being repaired, so we're in this bridle today. We've been having this absolutely ridiculously mild weather, so at the moment Ghost is just in a fleece sheet. Excuse that massive great big hole where he's ripped one of the clips out. Anyway, so I'm putting on Ghost's saddle. I have an Albion jump saddle. He wears a Lemieux pad with a Cavalo gel pad. I love this saddle, it is the most comfortable thing I've ever sat in. On his girth I do have to use fleece covers because he does have quite sensitive skin. Next it's on with riding wear. I wear my body protector when I hack. This is just because for some reason it makes me feel really secure. And also my hat, which is a champion. And this is one of my matchy matchy hat silks, which is grey. Finally, the most important piece, the high vis. This is very essential, super warm, loving the long arms on it. And on with my Ariat Tech Clubs. So on we get, yes, Ghost is 17 hands tall and despite being 6 foot 2, I still need to use a mountain block to get on. Anyway, I'll leave you now to enjoy the hacking in the countryside of Somerset. On the way back home, we cross over the motorway bridge. This is the M5, and I'm always absolutely astounded by the fact that Ghost is more scared of a plastic bag than he is of lorries hurtling underneath him at 70 miles an hour. So both boys are absolute saints crossing over here. Not an issue at all. It was a little bit windy today, which is why Ghost doesn't like he's gonna get blown over. And we're back home, time to untack, bridle off, Ghost ready to try and knock the camera over, and then he can have a good old scratch on his hay net. And rolling up my stirrups, posting the stirrup leathers through. This is so I can put my fleece saddle cover over my saddle. Taking off his girth, taking off the fleece covers, and I like to hang these up separately to make sure they dry in case they're sweaty. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed tacking up and hacking with me, and I'll catch up with you soon. Thanks then, bye!